There's a reason why they call it an ecosystem. Because when it comes to nature, species are performing this incredibly intricate, delicate dance with one another. And it is so finely balanced that if you take out just one species, it can end up having a catastrophic effect that cascades all the way down through the food chain, a trophic cascade as it's known. And that is what happened in Utah in the first half of the 20th century. A state national park had a flood of new visitors, which had a detrimental impact on the population of cougars that lived there. Cougars eat deer. And so the deer were quite happy about this turn of events. Their population flourished. But deer have a habit of grazing on pretty much everything they see. So the knock-on effect was a reduction in the diversity of the greenery around. That then had an impact on butterflies and birds and reptiles and so on. This incredible delicacy of the complex network of species, viewed from one perspective, can make it look like it's quite fragile. But actually, from another perspective, it can really be a strength of an ecosystem. Because sometimes there are certain species, certain keystone species as they're known, which when reintroduced in the right time at the right place, can have a positive impact that cascades both upwards and downwards just by reintroducing one single keystone species. <laughs>